Happy New Year 2015, everyone. I hope you all had a wonderful New Year's Day. I hope we all have a great 2015 and things get better for all of us, especially financially, if anyone is going through some financial issues. If you are a 90s kid, a 90s baby, or you know her after the 90s, if you were born after the 90s, you know, somewhere in the 2000s or whatever, Christine Kavanaugh unfortunately passed away at the age of 51. Yes, only 51. It's always the good ones who leave too soon. The first time I heard that she died was early New Year's Day morning. People saying, did you hear about Christine Kavanaugh passing away? You think you can make a tribute video for Christine Kavanaugh, which I will do. I was shocked. You know, I was really hurt. Like there was some kind of pain in my chest. I was very shocked. I was like, oh, come on. No. Why? I think everyone did not know she passed away until around New Year's Day or the day before New Year's Day. Because she died on December 22nd in Cedar Lake, Utah from undisclosed causes so we're not sure how she died there's probably an autopsy that we will hopefully find out the cause of her death I want to know the cause of her death I mean that sucks she died three days before Christmas she didn't get to see Christmas in 2014 she didn't even make it to the new year 2015 it's not right dying around the holidays I mean, first Christine Kavanaugh, and then the one poor mother who was shot and killed at a Walmart by her two-year-old son. I'll talk about that another time. Miss Kavanaugh, she has done so much, leaving us with such great memories that we cannot forget. She did a voice of Babe the Pig from the movie Babe. Uh, she had a role in Darkwing Duck where she was a voice of Goslin Mallard. She was a voice of uh, Bunny from that one Sonic the Hedgehog show. She was also the voice of another bunny character from that one Powerpuff Girls episode. You know, the whole job, job, ch -ch -ch job, job, bunny do good, bunny do good. <laughs> that was a funny episode. Oblina from I Real Monsters. And she was best known voicing two of our favorite characters from Nickelodeon and Cartoon Network. I'll give you a hint. They both wear glasses, sound the same, scream the same way, and are both redheads. And if you said Chucky from Rugrats and Dexter, you are correct. She did an amazing job voicing those two, especially Dexter. I just love the way Dexter talked, screamed, and was angry when yelling at Dee Dee. Miss Kavanaugh did such an awesome job. She also did some acting as well. She was in shows like Cheers and Salute Your Shorts, Jerry Maguire, The X-Files, Everybody Loves Raymond, ER. Apparently, Christine Kavanaugh retired due to wanting to spend more time with the family, which is understandable. So she pretty much retired from both acting and voice acting in 2001. Uh, she unfortunately just didn't have enough time for family when voice acting and acting. I believe if she would have found another way to spend more time with her family, she probably would have never retired and continued to voice acting and probably a little bit of acting as well. I mean, since her retirement, she was never heard from since. So we weren't sure if maybe, you know, she was still alive where she was or maybe, you know, died. But, you know, she was still around. We just never heard from her ever again since. And, you know, she was replaced by new actresses for Rugrats and Dexter's Lab. And it seems like both shows kind of went downhill since she left. I was and I'm, I still am so emotional on the inside about her death. And, you know, I took a look at my Rugrats Chucky puzzle in my room just thinking about this beautiful woman. She really is and was beautiful from the inside and out. All I can say is... Rest in peace, Christine Josephine Kavanaugh. You left us too soon, but your memories will live on when watching Rugrats, Dexter's Lab, and Babe, and all the other works you were a part of. You truly are beautiful and wonderful. God rest your soul, you beautiful woman. Tell me your thoughts on the death of Christine Kavanaugh. Where were you when you heard the news? What was your reaction? Share your best memories about Christine Kavanaugh, please. Happy 2015, everyone. And God bless.